Hello everybody and welcome back to Yonder the Cloud Catcher Chronicles. Oh, some very loud insects and birds and things around here. So, yes, now we apparently need to craft a thousand gil... Well, is it gills in this? Oh, it's gold. I don't know what V stands for. But a thousand's worth of tinker items. I wonder if I can do that just now. Oh, yes. Would help if I was using my controller again. I always forget that for some reason. Okay, so... If I go into my inventory... Let's have a look at what we can craft with tinker items. I mean, I'm sure I would like to have a thousand's worth of tinker items. That'd be great. Oh, let trigger buttons. Right, okay, so... I can make a tinker's kit out of clay and wood. And that's a basic item needs as part of a job. So to make a gear, I need tinker's kit, machine parts, iron ingot, bits and bobs. Okay. Cogs and gears. Well, to make a gear, I need cogs and bits and bobs. Oh, wow. This is quite in-depth, isn't it? I could make a fertilizer maker, but I don't really know why I would need that right now. I mean, a cheese maker would be more useful, I think. Or a butter churner. How do I get bits and bobs? I'm pretty sure someone said that they would give me bits and bobs in return for items. Yeah, I think I need to collect more stuff before I do any of that. So let's have a look on my compass and see if we've got any good other things we can do. So I can make a stone bridge, but I can't actually make the arches and stuff I need for that. I can do needle and thread, or I can still try and find the missing crew that I still, still haven't found. Why don't we do needle and thread? So I just need to actually go back to Lion Main Joss. Okay, well, let's do that. Let's run back to them. I unfortunately um, came over here without really thinking that I needed to just, I should have just stayed there and done my, my quest there, but never mind. We get to do an awesome Geronimo. To fly for ages, look. Actually, really high up up there. I should really pick up all these flowers and things like that. Anything I can. So, like, if I can see grass, I need to be picking all that up. Beautiful. I'll just run over there, I think, and just grab things on the way. And then we're going to have to see what we can do in terms of exploring, I think, because there's not many quests yet. Or if there are, I haven't found them. Let's see. We got any around? Got that sage stone that I never found. Um, needle and thread quest. There's a quest in the murk there. How many sprites do we have now? Now that's a question, because uh, we've got a few now, haven't we? I'm sure it tells me in here, somewhere. Yeah, we have seven at the moment. I think that's maybe what I was doing in there, I was trying to find. Oh, probably need to go up the hill here. I was trying to find uh, more sprites by going to different areas. I think there are a few sprites. I found cub up in that area. Oh, that grass is growing back. Oh, I can't resist it. Can't resist the grass. Have to cut it. La 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 la. It rumbles my controller pad when I uh, cut the grass for some reason. I don't know why that is. 
and yet it doesn't rumble it when I hit a rock which is when you would think it would happen oh actually that wasn't as far away as it could have been I thought I'd be walking for ages I heard a cat someone's someone was saying in the comments I can I can pick up cats I can hear a cat oh look there I can collect it hey I discovered a spotted round cat eight more to go okay so whenever I hear a little meowing cat I shall go and pick it up from now on I need to get up from the beach though. Get some rocks on the way. Some stuff I planted. Yeah, uh, I probably will miss like picking up certain flowers, certain chests and things. It seems to me like in this game you're going to be able to revisit everywhere so many times that uh, if I miss something I'll probably just be able to find it again next time. I want to know how to mine those. They're, they're annoying me. They just look like they should be able to be mined. They look like they're metal. There's a murk over there. Can I get to it? I think I'm just going to go down here. And try and find my way through this horrible maze. It's so maze-like. It's so annoying. So like I can't find my way around. Yeah, I'm going to go directly there as much as I can. I think it's this way. certainly something here oh yeah this is the tannery I remember and then that goes into the cloth town oh what a run there we are oh down there I think hopefully oh no I got stuck down here again that's so annoying. Need to go round. Can I jump that height? No. To go all the way around. It's up this side. I will eventually start to remember that this town is ridiculous and has a bit in the middle that doesn't go anywhere. I mean, you would think that they would build some sort of slope or ladder to help with that situation, but oh no. No, no, no. Um, is it up here? Ah, here. This is the right way. Is Lion Mane Joss here, please? Oh, there's someone with a quest. <laughs> That's cosy again. Oh, gosh. It's you again. So what do you think? Oh. This is one of my cute marts that you'll see located around Gamir. I'm bringing grothel themed fashion to the masses. Ah! Thank you so much for your help. And remember, at cute mart, we turn drab into fab. I really don't know what I did there, but she seems really happy, so I'm really glad she's got her little shop. Um. <laughs> Hello, Lion Mane Joss. Ah! Well done, traveller. Fine work. Simple though this item is from it you can create more fabulous finery ah. welcome to the tailor's guild please take this recipe as a reward for your fine work go forth and be fabulous cool so i've got my novice badge with uh, the tailors now and i've got some leather strips and things so let's have a look and see if we can actually make anything well, actually all these recipes are going to tink up um yarn canvas rucksack leather haversack Cardigan. Fur trousers. Leather placard. Long trousers. Oh, there's some cute clothes you can make. A long sleeve wrap. Whatever that says. <laughs> Traveller slacks. 
And that's that's our lot. Okay, so let's have a quick look. See what all these things need to be made. Uh, so I don't have chef or carpenter or constructor yet. I've got tinker. Don't have brewer. I've got tinker and tailor, and that's it. So we still got one, two, three, well, five more things to no, four more things to go because I think we have Wayfarer already. So let's see if Taylor's any more easy than the Tinker's Guild. So Taylor's kit is twine and wood. I don't have any twine at the moment. Yarn is Taylor's kit and fluff. Okay. See, I don't know whether um, the Taylor's kit, once you make it, stays with you. Let's see if it did with the Tinker's kit. Doesn't seem to, no. So I wonder if you have to make it every time. Oh, that's annoying. I was trying to make it and I pressed the wrong button. So I can make a Tinker's Kit. Right, so I made the Tinker's Kit. Machine parts, cogs. Bits and bobs, mortar, keystones. All these things I just don't have. Crazy. Right, so actually, thinking about it. No, I need twine before I can do pretty much anything, I think. So let's see if any of the traders have the things I kind of need. Surely all these flowers and rocks I'm picking up could be traded for something. Oh, the trader was up there. Hang on. Trader. Around here somewhere. Oh, look, there's someone with a quest. Hello. Oh. Old Lady Beckett. Oh my, this is quite upsetting. <clears throat> All of my cats have run away, all because of that wretched fur bag next door. Oh. My poor little babies. Oh. Can you please do something about that Merkspawn flea pile so my poor babies can come home? Um. Find Scruffily. That's the dog I spoke to a minute ago. Poor Scruffily. Are you Scruffily? Yeah. I uh, found him, and I talked to him. <coughs> and I talk to her again. Ah, oh, that's Scruffy's owner, Zoe. <coughs> woof, good day to you. Woof, woof, my toy broke. I got bored and played with the cats. <coughs> woof, woof, howl, howl. But the cats ran away. But I love cats. Woof, woof, I'm ever so sorry. Oh, Scruffly. He destroys toys quicker than I can make them. And old Lady Beckett is mad because he's scared of her cats. I'm the only person in a village full of tailors who can't sew. It's my secret shame. Oh, no. I can only make toys out of paper. Can you take this recipe and make a toy for Scruffly? Just don't tell anyone I'd die of shame. <laughs> no. I'll make a toy cat. Oh, how cute. Okay, let's see what we can do. Actually make something. So I have no doubt that I'm supposed to be making a thousand's worth of tailoring items. Toy cat. I need two yarn ball things. Two twine. And I have all the rest of the stuff except for haberdashery. Okay. Can I make haberdashery? Oh, I think I have to buy haberdashery, so... Okay. Let's see where the, the uh, trader is and see if we can get these things. Right, so. Haberdashery for two. That's not too bad. Just buy one for now. And any... Yarn is eight. Have any twine? Nope. You have yarn, so I've got, I could buy a yarn. I don't really want twenty-seven of them. Can I go back to one at the end? No. Maybe you want like one. I can't remember how many I needed actually. Let's go and have a look. So. Uh, Taylor, 
toy cat. Two of those. Two. To I do need twine. Where am I going to find twine? I might have to go to the other trader for that. But she certainly doesn't seem to have it. Got a fishing pole though. Nope. Dies and a chef's kit. What? What? Why are you selling chef's kits when you're like in the haberdashery town or whatever it's called? Right, I'm gonna go up the top and check the trader around the top and see what they have and whether they can help me make this toy cat. this way up here or oh, is that just cozy's place oh no there's a trader in there definitely okay so the trader inside cozy's hello mr trader do you have twine no you just have all of cozy's stuff right okay so we're all gonna have to go out into the world on a mission for twine i think So that must be a mission I've taken, yeah. Let's have a look at my quests. So, Taylor Guildmaster is to make, again, a thousand worth of Taylor items. Okay. I want to have a look at my map. Right, I think we should go and see whether we can clear some of these mercs now. Um, I really probably should have explored there a bit more, but it doesn't seem like a very big area. And there's an area beyond it. Area beyond here as well. That I could maybe try and go to. And maybe on the way I'll find bits and bobs that I can use. Or traders that I can, that can help me with my uh, tasks. Because at the moment, I do not have enough stuff. Just do not. So I'll come back and do the cat later once I've picked up a few more bits and bobs and seen some more traders. Ah, there's a trader out here. So if they do twine, I might be able to do the cat. Let's have a look. What do you trade? Um, leather, leather strips, hide, pickaxe. Oh yeah, fishing pole. Oh yeah. And a trap. But nothing I can particularly... I don't think I can particularly afford those things at the moment. And I want to explore more first, because I might end up getting them for free as part of a quest or something. Welcome to the Fiffle Dip Tanners. We can make you a leather for two hide. Okay. I don't know where I would get hide anyway. There's not even combat in this uh, game, so where would we find hide? Okay, let's go and find the Merc up there. Let's see if we can get up there. Firstly, which is sometimes easier said than done. Uh, that's a dead end, I think. Oh, look at the pretty waterfall. So we might have to go all the way out and round. Someone there that will exchange things. Let's have a look. What will you exchange? Uh. You fish for... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fish for kingdom coins, I think it is. But I don't know how to fish yet, so that's unfortunate. I'm going away from the merc now. Which wasn't really what I wanted to do. I just wanted to try and get up the top of there, didn't I? Doesn't seem to be happening. How do I get up there? I need that pickaxe so badly. I need to um, smash every crate I find just in case there's like twine in one of them. Okay, feeling a little bit. Right. Oh, I can't get up there either. I need a way up. Oh, I'm back to Farty Fen now, am I? Lovely. Just such a nice, welcoming place, this one. Got 
got to be a way to get up onto the top. So I can try and get these mercs cleared. See, I'll get up there and there'll be eight each or something. You watch. So we're on the beach again. Aha, I think this is the way up. Yes, good, 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 good. I'm really hoping... Oh, can I plant, a plant something there? Do I have any seeds at all? That one? Nope. Apparently not. They're not tree seeds or something, I guess. Okay, so let's see if this Merc... Oh, yes, it's seven sprites. Fantastic. Lumi and friends, thank you very much. There's probably another... Another bridge. Good spot for a suspension bridge. Oh, it's only wood and vines. Fantastic. That'd be so much handier to be able to go across a suspension bridge. So we'll just cut a couple of these trees down, I think. See if we can get enough. So that's uh, nearly enough, actually. I don't worry too much about finding wood because there's always trees around. I'm supposed to be able to replant them as well, but uh, I don't seem to have the seeds for it. Okay, well, I can do the bridge now. Great stuff. And does that mean I can get secrets? Must do. This must be a secret place. Either that or just a really, really convenient place to be going. Right, so let's have a look on the map, shall we? Oh, wrong way. So if I follow along here, I'll come to another Merc. But if I go backwards, there's another Merc there as well. Um, I'm going the right way. Not at all. I need to be going towards the east. Okay. Head east. So that's north. That way. Then this way must be east. Back across the bridge. Okay. Am I going there? Oh, I can see it. Yeah, I can see it on my map now. Where is it? Okay, I'll try running round here. Following the path around. Aha, there we go. Oh, that looks like another constellation. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, I've got enough now. It's good having seven sprites. It's about the right amount for this area. It's really cool. So, let's go get this one. Discover constellation Panatus the Wise Scholar. Fantastic. Right, what other mercs did we have? I'll pull over to that side, which I needed to go across the suspension bridge for. That's fine. Follow the path back round, I think. Oh, fabbits are so cute. I wish I could have them on my farm. So yes, this is a very handy bridge. 100%. There's also something down there that I don't know, I've never seen before. Oh, there is a way down, I, th I think. No, there isn't really a way down. Is that a way down? So if I go down there, I might never come back. Hmm. I might be able to get around that way. Oh, you know what? I can't resist. Can't resist a little bit of exploration. Got my hammer out. Fantastic. One day I might actually find something decent in there. Some coal and things like that. Right, so what's over here then? There better be something good. 
can see something. Oh, it's like a big statue. Okay. Show me your personality. Clothing is a very personal form of expression. Wear a new outfit. All right. Um, I could wear this top hat. You get into my clothing bit. Right, so I could wear the top hat. Okay, we'll try this again. How do I wear the top hat? A to wear. That's one, hopefully. Yep. And we could also try and wear a different hairstyle. That counts as two. Fantastic. And then we could try and... Mm. Wear a different hairstyle. Oh, that one. That one we haven't worn yet. Grease of hair. Oh, look at me. <laughs> look how weird I look. <laughs> Is that three? No. Oh, man. Mm. What else can we do? We can put our bow back on. I don't really want to dye my hair. I really don't want to. I like my hair colour. Don't have enough clothes to do this. Why did I sell my old clothes? So annoying. Oh, right, so I have to be in completely a new outfit to what I was wearing when I saw the stage stone. Okay, I see. So three completely different bits of clothing. I do not have that. That's very annoying. I suppose unless I dye my hair. But no, I actually think it probably wants me to have new hair, hat and tunic or something like that. I'm pretty sure, so... We'll carry on just looking for mercs then. Oh, it's all raining. I'll need to change my outfit. Yuck. There's one up here somewhere. Oh, look, there's a little... I could take shelter in here. Shelter from the rain. Got some more mushrooms so I can try and get farm hands eventually. Get enough of them. Smash that stone. So you do get a little bit of keypad rumble when, uh, so I control the rumble when you smash a stone, but it's not as much as it is when you pick up grass, which is a bit weird. Oh yes, I finally got some twine. Oh, thank goodness for that. Pick up everything in the world. Okay, it seems like that murk is over the other side of the canyon, unfortunately. I'm going to have to go all the way over there to get it. They kind of look like faces for a sec. Something else up here though, so we may as well keep exploring. What is that? That looks rather exciting. What are you? Blue glowy thing. Yeah, there's a trader here, I think, somewhere, apparently. Might be in a cave underneath, though, because uh, I'm not seeing him up here. 
Yeah, let's go and see what this is. It looks cool. Oh, all right. I'll go in there. It sends me somewhere else. Oh, if we go back in there, it's connected to here. Okay. So let's see where it sent me. Let's go back in and see where it sent me. So go in here, teleport, and we're all the way back up there. Oh, that's great. Cool. Well, while I'm back up here, I may as well just go and explore a little bit around these new regions that I haven't seen yet. So kind of around there, I haven't been up there at all. There's a whole big region there that I haven't been in very much at all either. So yeah, why don't we just explore around here a bit? Now I'm trying to find mercs and I'm trying to find quests, but there don't seem to be many around anymore. Two down there, one across there. A couple of traders up there. Just trying to think what to do really. I'm going to try and go into this area. This area was like a fishing area. And I found cub down here, I think. But we could go a little bit further along and see if we could find anything new. It was pretty cool finding the portals. I think that was pretty good. I am disappointed that I didn't have enough... Uh... Oh, I have discovered a sprig pig. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm pretty disappointed I didn't have enough clothes for that sage stone. I wanted to know what it did. And, like, just for the sake that I couldn't change my top or my trousers or something, I missed out on that. So I feel a bit like, aww. Oh, what's this up here? Oh, that looked like there was a way in. Oh, no, there is. Haha, -ha, little tiny. Okay, that wasn't exciting. It's just going to be all the way down to the sea here. Some metal there, I think. If I had a pickaxe, I don't think I could. Well, it may be good to afford one if I sold like everything in my inventory. Oh, a chest. Cyan shampoo. Oh, what's in here? Well, this looks pretty cool. Like a little town. I have discovered Mocha Bay, and that looks like a sprite to me. Picture. Tasty food all around. Tasty food. I chow down. Oh, that looks like something tasty in your backpack. Oh, cute. Oh, so cute. There's another one, apparently, somewhere. Loads of people with quests and stuff, though. That's really good. Yeah. Hola, traveller. Brought here by the smell of my food, no? This, the smell is marveloso. It's marvellous, yes? Yeah. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Jojo Posen Hero, Chef Extraordinario. Extraordinaire. And leader of the Chef's Guild. Oh. We are the legends of lunch, the masters of brunch, the kings and queens of dinner, the sirens of sweets. Uh, yeah? Yeah. To join, you need to show us you're made of the right stuff. Bring me water and oil. Okay. I do not have any water. I do not have any oil. Let's see if we can buy any, firstly. And if not, we'll have to come back later. Do you have water and oil? Well, you have water. Um... And you have oil. Yeah, cool. Water. Just one, please. And oil. Just one, please. So I need some backpack items to trade for it. Um, I have loads of fodder. 
can sell like 20 fodder. Oh, how much was it? Oh, 40. Okay. Sell you 40 fodder then. See, there's a reason why I cut all the grass down. Yep. Perfect. Very good, you have everything. Okay, take this and button, sorry, butterberry flour to River Drift Mill to make flour. Okay, where's River Drift Mill then? I don't know. Who are you? Oh, Jubilee, every day should be a celebration. I agree. Oh. Why don't you go grab me some festival juice and we can sing songs until the sun rises? Okay, that just sounds like you're using me for juice, honestly. You don't even know me. Well, a notice board here. I'm looking for a clay pots and leather. If you bring them to me, I'll reward you. Ezra. Nah. Nah. Nah, 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 nah. I can't be bothered taking things off boards where I have, don't have anything. Um, there's another quest like up here. How do I get up there? slightly confused as to how I get up there. Aha, it looks like there's a ramp. There we are. Try not to fall in the sea. Hello, mm. Lauren. Thief, scoundrel. Huh. Lousy lamington lifter. Oh. Someone saw my lamingtons. I baked cute ones for Nan Myrtle. She's been hiding since she got horribly sunburned the other day. Oh, I hate sunburn. I, I sympathise Nan Myrtle. I know Aimable, Imolkin, and Bax were nearby. Could you see if anyone saw anything? Sure, I might. Oh no, seriously? This is a lot of effort for some, like, cakes or whatever lamingtons are. Ah! Oops. I fell in the water. So I'm guessing all these green uh, exclamation marks are people uh. with clues. I thought I saw someone in a red tunic, but the sun was in my eyes. Amable and Bax have tunics that colour. So it's either Amable or Bax. Yeah. I saw Amable playing with her pet Squamble near Lauren's house earlier. That doesn't mean she's guilty. Mm. I heard the sound of a bell near the table. Bax has a bell in his bag that sounds just like that. Yeah. Did you see Imorkin's lovely new tunic? It's such a pretty red. Oh man. These clues are rubbish. Um. Go to Wilkins again. Mm. Amable's pet squamble got loose and was racing through town earlier. I thought it was carrying something. Right, okay, so I'm thinking maybe, maybe the Squamble stole it. I don't know what a Squamble is. Oh. Yeah, Malkin was waiting outside Lauren's house earlier. Okay. I think it's the Squamble's fault. Where's Emily? Oh, I don't know where everyone is. Oh, there's someone in there. Wanna jump in? Uh, how do I get in there? Is there steps? Ah, oh, yes. Ah. Emily says, Did you see Amable put her pet squamble a new bell? It's just like Bax's one. Yeah, I'm thinking it's the Squamble. Oh. Poor oh, Bax is so sick, he had to put a jumper on over his lovely red shirt. Okay, uh, so where's Bala then? Bala, there's someone around this way. Uh, last, last clue. Last clue off this person, whoever they are, wherever they are. Is that Bala? 
Hello. Yeah. That Malcolm was looking for Lauren earlier. Uh. Bax told me he could smell Lauren's baking from the other side of town. He has a sweet tooth. Okay. I will go to Lauren and that will be the end of the episode, I think. Because uh, we've been going for a while. I wanted just to finish that one off. But yeah, cool. We found Baker's Town. Bacon, Bacon Town. Hey, Lauren. Oh, no. I'm going to say it's Amable, and I think it's Amable's Squamble, personally. Uh. Hi, Lauren. Of course I took your lamington. She told me to. Huh. I did. <gasps> you said if you weren't around when I dropped by to just grab them and take them to Nan Myrtle. Oh. When I stopped by, Pixie ran off with poor Bax's bell and didn't have time to say I took the lamingtons. Huh. Gosh, I'm so embarrassed. Thank you, Amable. And you, my friend, I'm sorry I sent you on a, a, sorry, a wild fabbit chase. Hmm. Please have a lamington as a special thank you. And here's my secret recipe, too. I have lamington recipe. I wish I knew what one was. I'm going to look in my inventory and tell you what a lamington is. Oh, it's one of those. Those um, chocolate-covered cakey coconut things. I know what those are. I think they normally just call coconut squares or something around here. So I think they're, they're not very uh, interestingly named. But there we go. So we... Look, there's our new constellation. Oh, no, that's the old constellation. Where's our new constellation? Because we found another one, didn't we? Is it in the sky right now? Yes, it is. It's over there, look. Our new constellation. So that's it for me today. So um, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please leave me a like. And I hope to see you next time. But in the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.